Chris is discussing the idea that he doesn't need, he can bring suntan lotion and, and just pray and he doesn't need to worry about a jacket. Um, I, I don't think that's going to work out. Is that what so, I said? Is that what you, what, what'd you say? I think I said that I didn't bring my suntan lotion, uh, perhaps indicating some lack of faith that gonna be the sun. sun could shine and it could oh. reflect off shiny objects and, oh. and warm up our um, skin and add a little tint to it, possibly. Yeah. You know, snow will do that and the lake will do that, right? Yep, that's for sure. Definitely, definitely the truth. So my, my, my phone's having trouble with uh, orientation, so... So why did he please bring his uh, sun, sunscreen or protection cloth or... Well, I, I thought the story was going to be a lot better. I, I was thinking the story was going to be a lot more more colorful. The way you were going initially, but... No, no, no. Uh, that, would, that would have been like, oh... Yeah. <laughs> you know, uh, uh, it's always in mind when I'm outside, do I need suntan lotion, right? I don't usually worry about suntan. I wasn't blessed with as much melanin as some are, okay? My, my skin usually allows me not to have problems with sunburn, but not 100% of the time. Uh, that, that my daughter is pretty good against sunburn. With no guitar. Robert, no guitar. No guitar? No guitar. That's, that answer that question. Can you play all of this? 30 degree weather or whatever it is. You just might choose not to today. How was, better, how was your Veterans Day, Diana? Windy. Very windy. Do <laughs> you do anything special? Uh, Diana was on a bridge with us. Yeah. Oh, you were on the bridge? Oh, you're over in Hudson again? It was very windy. They bring you both sides of the bridge. Now we can open it for us. So, do you want to open up the prayer, Scott? good camaraderie and uh, good focus on what is good and what's right and what's true in our own lives and in America. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. That was a good one, bros. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> That's one of their requirements. Anyone time that one? No, he, 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 he had a pithy one. <laughs> Where are you now? Yeah. Okay, I got, a, <laughs> I got two verses to share. Okay. Uh, uh. <laughs> We're gonna be... This is short also. I, I wanted to have more for you, but I was just like short on time. Oh. And so, um, these are about um, that we're a new creation. Okay. We become change, tra totally transformed by Jesus Christ, the gospel by the Holy Spirit. That's what it's about. It's not me trying to change myself. I'm not going to get far. No. I'm going to fall. I'm going to trip. Um, it's not something, maybe I, you know, it's just a show. You're just putting on a show and you yeah. try to pretend like you're righteous when yeah. inside you know, you're something else. Yeah. Holy Christ can transform us. Only the Holy Spirit. Yeah. And so we want to experience that. Second Corinthians 5.17 Therefore, if anyone is in Christ, he is a new creature. The old things pass away. Behold, new things have come. So consider yourselves your old life dead and now you're living a brand new life surrender to Christ uh, ask him to fill you with the Holy Spirit and you'll be a totally changed person not just outwardly but the motives of our heart the thoughts of our mind the um, intents 
of our heart. The, it's all going to change in Christ. You can't help but change because Jesus just overwhelms our old nature and it just starts to leave and we become brand new, brand new people. And uh, Isaiah, how about Old Testament? Isaiah 43, 18, do not call to mind the former things or ponder things in the past. That's my old life is gone. Goodbye. This is my new life in Christ. He's got everything is good in Christ. It changed. Behold, I will do something new. Now it will spring forth. Will you not be aware of it? And it says he'll make a roadway in the wilderness, rivers in the desert to give drink to my chosen people. The people whom I have formed for myself will declare my praise. And so Jesus in Revelations says he'll make all things new. So he's going to make a new universe, a new earth. And I, there's not going to be any darkness or suffering or pain in it. In the meantime, he's making a new people as he makes his home in our hearts and lives. The kingdom of heaven has come into our hearts and lives. And uh, we have new life in Christ, a changed life. And let's forget our life, how it used to be, and let's move forward with what he has. Even for America, um, yeah, we want it restored. But when Jesus restores things, he doesn't make it, oh, make it like it used to be. Oh, we want it, things to be how they used to be. No, we don't. We want things to be better than they used to be. <laughs> Re restoration, when Jesus restores something, it's better than it was. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I do appreciate, don't get me wrong, I do appreciate the foundation of this nation and all the blessings. And I want Jesus to even make it better than it was then. And that's my vision for each of our lives, that we're just transformed by the gospel of Christ by the Holy Spirit and that this nation and we become um, we experience the newness of life will be even better than we imagined in the future for us individually for our relationships our churches and for our nation and so that's my little thing to do one of the things that you were talking about was not about making making the, the world great again or making America great again. You were talking about making it better. So how, how, how would how, how, how would you apply that to uh, like the situation we're having right now with the uh, um, um, the dawn? I forget what the, the new the new uh, the new slogan for the Trump people is. Um, um, basically, they're taking after um, Reagan. Remember Reagan when. Um, you know when, when when Reagan came out talking about Carter and how how bad it was under Carter, and the uh, current Republican position on that is basically that um, that they're they're going to run basically the same campaign as Reagan did in 1980. Oh yeah. Um, basically, it's a new dawn is coming or something to that effect. Um, I forget what exactly their their, their motive, what their uh, slogan is going to be, but. They're basically saying um, we're going to come out of this darkness that's taken over right now. And uh, you know. yeah, Reagan's a good example as someone in America who um, really rescued us in a sense from a lot of this um, as we move. You know, people tend to move toward socialism and communism because it's the easy way they print money for you and so forth, take care of you. They promise, which they can't fulfill. Print money, but the problem is the products become expensive. You look at Venezuela and they'll print they'll print money and they'll just keep adding zeros to it. And then they add one zero to the money and the price of the stuff in the store, you add two zeros to it. Well, that's why, that's because that's why the founders had gold and silver money in the country. is the less that it's worth right and the rarer that it is the more that it's worth same like with with job skills if you have if you have a job that everybody can do 
you know, it's not going to pay much. But if you have a rare job skill, you're going to, you're going to, uh, sure. Yeah. You know, supply and demand. Huh? Supply and demand. Yeah, supply and demand. Part of well, if you ever, it's definitely demand based too. Because yeah. let's say if you're the only guy that makes buggy whips, yeah, and the demand for buggy whips is pretty much zero, you're not necessarily going to be because there's no demand. Yeah, there's yeah. no demand for buggy whips. You know, at some sure. point the buggy whip to buggy whip demand went to zero. Practically, it's, it's kind of like it's kind of like farmers if they, you know, if they grow just nothing but corn and then everybody grows corn, they're not going to get much money for it. Yeah. So let them diversify their their crops and they grow like a lot of different kinds of stuff right? yep. so it's kind of the same thing with money when you create money out of thin air like they do yeah so you have to and you have debts like that you have to devalue the dollar because you can't afford to pay it back you can't afford to pay your debts but you can keep playing the game if you keep devaluing the dollar like look at what the dollar is worth now to 40 years ago and we'd be shocked right but a silver dollar will will buy you the same stuff it did 40 years ago but silver and gold the actual so far silver, silver dollar value. yeah we'll buy you the yeah. same amount of stuff it did because the silver ago. dollar is worth 20 bucks or whatever yeah yeah but this, back when it was worth a dollar well you know what you could buy for a dollar costs about 20 bucks now so yep. it's like yeah, that's yeah. the idea. The same thing with the gold coins, you know, like the the, the ten dollars, yeah. twenty, the, the eagles and stuff. Yeah, they were pretty expensive, you know, valuable back in the day. And nowadays, they're worth quite a lot, you know, just in their gold value. So yeah. What about the uh, the, the new idea of making that platinum coin? All oh, platinum. They're talking about making a platinum coin and yeah, sticking I, one I'm trillion sure. oh, dollars. Oh, the, the Federal Reserve thing there? Yeah, I've heard about That's that. That's going to be platinum-based. What yeah, a platinum's, stupid idea. Platinum's worth a lot of money right now. It's not, one, one ounce of platinum is not worth a trillion dollars. No. That, but that's what it would be, a platinum coin. Yeah. And all, all, they, were, all they would do is take a standard platinum coin and change the, the, you know, the number on it. I mean, if they, if they, if you, we use platinum coins for actual real currency, that may not be a bad idea. You know, I don't, I don't know, if, I don't know if the, I, I did, do they know, do they know platinum existed back in the, you know? Doesn't matter. They, they, they could, they could use any kind of rare, rare earth metals for yeah. coins. Yeah. You know, um, bronze. They use bronze true. too. Although gold is not as very decorative. Yeah. Unlike some. Yeah. metals you know yeah the only problems that they used to have with silver and gold coins using those for money was the idea of clipping yeah that's how they, that's that's what created uh you know that's that's kind of what uh, created um like inflation and currency devaluation yeah when they started shaving off little bits of gold yeah and then, and then the merchants and then the, and the business people and then they started raising their prices when that happened yeah and then the king would institute price controls right and then yep. it kind of which basically leads to an economic collapse when yeah. it happens. That's the worst thing to do is inst institute price controls. Well, yeah. since we're on that subject, did you notice that inflation is 6.2% the highest in 30 years? Yep, they say that it's the worst. Right now, we're in the worst situation that we've been in in 30 years. Yep. And the previous year, while they're doing all this printing, all the economic, how do you say the word? economic people economists, economists sorry all the economists all the stock advisors the government they're all saying this is transitory this is just transitory they're probably, yeah, the Fed, probably keynesian the Fed said that. Yeah, this is all trans it's kind of like they're using psychology to kind of keep the markets going like well, you know, print try money. It. Some people are going to benefit, but ultimately, it's going to just destroy the whole the whole world. Because the government, no matter what you do with the government, the government can't do as good a job with the money that they get as the as the person they took it from. You know, whoever you took the money from probably would be a better better user of that money and yeah. and have been, benefited society more than what the government does with that same dollar. Especially if they worked hard for it. Yeah, because the the person the person and they value have people the, to take care of. They're like the irresponsible child that blows his allowance money, you know, and doesn't spend it wisely. That's basically what government is. 
Well, I could go all day long yeah. on, on examples of government spending yeah. and how, how they skew markets to do illogical stuff because the government is dropping money into it. And so let's just say something costs 80% 80, 80 more to do, but the government will pay half of it. Well, people will do it then. And it's like, so you'll spend 80% more to do the same thing just because the government pays half? Well, it's because it's cheaper. The government's paying half, so really it's a 10% discount. It's a 10% discount because the government's paying half of it. But the government is the people. The people are paying it. In the end, when you have this inflation and this money printing and this deep debt, the rich get richer. Yep. And the poor and the middle class go down, which is now happening in America. Yeah. So well, you're, almost you're going to put more money into rich people's hands. It you know, I, you know, I thought one of the best people is that under, understands it. it is Ron Paul, right? That's why I supported him for president in 2012. He's got a book called End the Fed. He yeah. was, oh, he's the guy that's always trying to get rid of the Federal Reserve. And there's a book also called The Creature from Jack Island by G. Edward Griffin. That's yeah. a real good one, too. It's like the history of the Federal Reserve. <laughs> one of the of, things about the, the really problem. wealthy people is yeah. they, they're able to float. Basically, you know, you, you put taxes on them, all they do is pass it on to their customers. Anything that you do to super wealthy people, all it does is just gets passed on to regular people. Well, I, I suppose there, there's a difference between their personal wealth and then their like business wealth too, right? Cause, Both of them, yeah. yeah. Corporations and business people. The business yeah. people are so diversified that if, it doesn't matter what you do to the economy, they're still going to own a certain percentage of the total thing. But they, they actually, these big corporations like these high taxes and a lot of regulations. Yep. Because they got deep pockets, they can afford it, where the little guy gets crushed by it. Yep. And so, that's what they like. That's how they control everything. That's exactly right. Yeah. Yeah. That's how they get their monopolies and stuff. Walmart yep. loves regulations because they have a, such yeah. a big, or, whereas their competitors can't handle it. Yeah. You, know, you put all these regulations on one of the Walmart's competitors, and they they, they just go out of business. So when it, when it, Walmart winds up being a monopoly. All these big companies like that stuff. You know. you know, or they or they come in there and they and they uh, you know they they sell everything artificially cheap, and then all the little guys go out of business. And once that happens, then they raise their prices on it. Yep. That. Yep. Yep. You know, and then exactly. pay their workers like lousy wages too. Yep. You know, you just yeah. You go to Costco in a location right next to where a Sam's Club is and the prices are a lot cheaper than a Costco just 10 miles away where there isn't a competitor. So they, they do it all the time. Yeah. Well, we see the government uh, printing and paying money. Um, it appears to do it for votes. And it seems to be getting more and more direct now with Biden um, planning to give 450000 per immigrant who's separated from family. That is like so insane <coughs> that, so so if there's a family of four and they're all divided, they each get 450,000. That's like 1.5 million or so, more than that. And- uh, Well, they're all gonna wanna gonna get make divided. Them millionaires just so they can vote for the Democrat party. You're willing to bankrupt this country and bankrupt Americans so you can get votes. Yeah. That is getting really, I mean, that's, isn't that almost Probably like. We have a visitor coming up to see us, I think. Isn't that almost for like. Um, for Diana. What's, what's it called when you um, go against your country and try to destroy it? Treason? Isn't that almost treason? Handing out millions of dollars. That is treason, absolutely. Immigrants. So you're here That's for totally the rosary. To work for yeah. Yeah. You're setting up some of the. You're like because treason consists of like uh, giving aid and comfort to the enemy. Well, I'd say they're an enemy when they when they come into this country illegally. If they're just pouring money from enemy countries too, right? Into other people's yeah. hands who haven't worked for it. Doesn't it say you reap what you sow? Shouldn't you have to work for your money and not be just giving it? When you're well, able-bodied. The, the Bible says if a man does not work, he shall not eat. And that's assuming well, he's able-bodied, he's able yeah. to work. So she went to yeah. her car. He just wants to live off others. Yeah, there's uh, no excuse for that. No. If you're able-bodied. If you're if you're if you're disabled or something, 
that's then, different. But that's but that's where the church would take care of that in private charities because they handle that stuff yeah, way would. better than governments do. Yeah, for sure. Because yeah. when government does it, it becomes a big bureaucracy and people tend to abuse it. Yeah, we would, and and also a lot of what they call um, disabled. You know, people can work in a wheelchair and do assembly work. Yeah, there are there are certain things they can do. Yeah, and you can work in a you can have an iPad in your wheelchair and do a lot of work. I saw a guy. I, I I met a guy once. He owned a small engine shop and he was in a wheelchair, but he could still like work on his stuff. It was like little like lawnmower size engines that he worked on. Yeah, you know, he was he was good at it. Right, and you know? people who are yeah struggle with depression. Yeah. They can do work too. In fact, outdoor work sometimes is good for depression. Getting exercise, sunlight, up trash. Yeah. Well, I don't know who this person is. I think that's a problem person walking up here. Is it? Yeah, problem person. How's that? It's well, Diana. How can, how can you oh. have a good world if, if you don't have problem people? You won't know what good is, right? Sometimes, yeah. <laughs> I think Diana got cold. You must have got cold. Yeah, I Why? I had it parked up with my handicap. Oh, okay. Oh. I'm loading. Okay, yeah. Hi. All right, yeah. We're loading. I do. Good, good, good. Good to see you. Good to see you. It's been a while. Yeah, yeah. Olivia's supposed to show you up, so I think I'm going to You haven't been talking. Nobody even knows you're here. Hi. Uh -huh. I don't know if I do that. You probably so are. So wait, what's Cammy going to like, what's he, like wearing a blanket <laughs> there or what? It might be. Yeah, at least I'm not cold. We all do kind of yeah. <laughs> I don't. Uh, at least I'm not He's wearing a blanket. That's a, wearing a blanket. How yeah. stylish, man. We're picking on people Just today. You never know what Cammy's We're going to harass next. Bruce. We have to harass yeah, Bruce, yeah, you know. I'm you know, the thing is, is she might be starting a new fashion trend, right? Yeah. Next thing you know, next year, everybody's there wearing blankets. Go. There you go. <laughs> right? Yeah. You know, it could be, right? Yeah, yeah. It is a blanket. It'll be nice. I thought maybe it was like some kind of a... Aren't they like trying to blanket us all out? Oh, the newest... Uh, oh, there you go, though. So, just so it literally is a blanket. <laughs> yeah. That's the newest trend. Next thing you know, there'll be, uh, what, Kanye wife's... And, and, uh, no, no, uh, uh, what, the Kardashians will be out there with their... Um, with their blankets. Who can I sue them? Because you know this is my idea. Yeah, here. idea. Yeah, exactly. But the only difference between the between the Kardashian blankets and the regular blankets are going to be, they're going to take this blanket trend and make it kind of kind of sketchy. Uh, they'll they'll do something to it that'll be right. Yeah, they'll do something. Yeah. Like big holes, yeah, like big holes, big holes in other. it, or. Yeah, you know. yeah, you I don't want to know. Yeah. Well, it says to the you perverted person, Jenner everything's perverted. What about, what about Kylie true. Jenner? She's pictured, to the pure you know, person, yeah, I would have, you know, covered in blood. Really? After the whole incident with that concert, I guess. Wow. Yeah. I'm not yeah. sure what's going on, but apparently she's yeah. his girlfriend at Travis Scott, whatever. I don't know, that's what they say. I don't know. Why would she, Why would somebody who was the girlfriend of the guy who was responsible for a lot of people? People having died, so go out on Twitter and cover yeah, herself in blood. That's kind of mentally. Yeah. What it is is she's trying to, trying to, you know, she's like mentally ill. I don't know. You don't celebrate that people died. Mm -mm. No. No. Seems kind of strange. They approve. Uh oh. This is uh, Diana. Lydia, I mean. I just had uh, cataract surgery, so my eyes are a, a, a march to support Roseville schools. <laughs> they passed two levies, and now a march to support <laughs> Roseville schools. So they're not even the right. They're not are, they, are they pushing it? <laughs> just so it just just I should, it'd have been nice if I could have walked. Carrying the sign. Are they are they promoting the film? Oh, you're both here. I thought it was going to be you and a friend. No, no they are not a friend. It's not here. Here, yes. Because Diana said you were bringing her friend. Yes, that uh, is her friend. That's her yeah. daughter. She looks a lot like her, I doesn't said, she? No, I said me, my daughter, and a friend. Oh, okay. And that friend is Rita. Rita's coming. Rita's coming. Oh, okay. Yeah, oh, okay. And then Sylvia. She's just coming. Sylvia. So. Yeah, where's the dogs? Uh, the dog. They stay home because me and the rosary is like hard to pray and yes, what the get a hold of them. Yeah, their paws get too cold when they're saying yeah. the rosary. I like the yeah. dog. You, get, you got your dog saying the rosary? 
they do, but uh, they don't Catholic let us dogs? concentrate too much. Catholic dogs. Oh, yeah. They actually cheer for Trump. Oh, they do. Yeah, uh, yeah. yeah they do. Yeah, yeah, when we start like uh, chanting, they start barking also, kind of like. <laughs> yeah, yeah I, when, could, I could hear it. <laughs> when they all said Hosanna and laid palm branches, when Jesus was coming into they, Jerusalem. Oh, yeah. Uh, the religious leaders, the experts, said, Stop the children, this is blasphemy. Stop them from praising. And what did Jesus say? If they don't praise me, the rocks and the trees will cry out <laughs> praises. And people have been, who have claimed to have been to heaven, they say in this heaven, the, the flowers and the plants sing praises to God in heaven. That is cool. Would that be something? Join in your join in your band. It's getting so scampy. All the flowers, the trees, and leaves praising the Lord. Imagine, yeah. I'm gonna go off because my uh, I don't know how good my video. I do have some people watching it, which is surprising. I'm probably gonna go with just my hand. How come you didn't bring a guitar, Scotty? Too cold. Too cold. Oh. Well, because one, for one, it's like it's not good on the wood on the guitar. For yeah, yeah. Extreme weather and the low humidity, and two, it's uh, it wouldn't stay in tune at all. Three, my dude, just my hands would be too uh, too cold. Yeah. So, yeah. I don't know. They should make. Maybe I could invent like a. Uh, should invent a guitar with like a little like a heater on it or something. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure it wouldn't stay in tune properly. No. No. No, I need to get. I need to. I need a device in my belt to create a like a, a heated force field around me, kind of like a Star Trek. So everybody's freezing. I'm standing at 72 degrees playing my guitar. Yeah, I got the heater in the car. I, I could have put the heater out here, but the, the heater wouldn't keep the air consistent enough. No, no. Oh, that's why I got my temperature. Well, I could, I could, you know, I could mid 50s maybe. That's just what's comfortable for me, you know, like like it's. Uh, I, we did a gig one time with the, with these guys, and it, it turned out it was supposed to be warmer, but it was only about like 50 degrees, and it was windy. It was like it was an outdoor gig we did in the fall one year, a few years ago. And he, you know, I got a video of it. And he's just tuning our guitars like after every song, and it's terrible. So we got some more videographers here today. Yeah, I don't know what they're here for. No, no. you play in the 50s. Yeah, because like a lot, of, like like some of these. Uh, Rallies that I've brought it to, it's like 55 or 60. I'll, and I'll bring it with me. I'm mean, kind of really, really, if I could, if if I can, uh, a good rule to go by. My, if I could go outside without a jacket with just a t-shirt on, then I could probably play my guitar. Although a light windbreaker jacket is okay too. I wanted to sing um, the Battle Hymn of the Republic today. I know all of the I know the well, I do it. I don't know. So they will be doing. Yeah. Do you want to lead us in that? So there's only four of you today. The numbers aren't going to be real high. But there, you got four powerful ones, though. Yeah. Do you guys? Do any I'm not used to singing without my guitar, though. Do any of you know Battle Hymn of the Republic? That one girl, Tara, can sing it. Tara, she uh, she sang that at the Capitol, the governor's mansion. I wanted to bring that up today. She's, she just belts it out, too. She she really does, man, I tell you. Can you, guys, can you call it up on your phone and we can sing Battle Hymn of the Republic? You're asking us to sing a hard song. <laughs> well, like I said, you know. Well, we, uh, we know the refrain. Glory, glory, hallelujah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, it's molded. Yeah. Yeah. But I found this really good um, I guess, spray that is natural. I guess it's so cold, people don't even want to bring their Whatever I want, but it's all natural. Yeah. Okay. Yep. I, yeah. So, so you spray oregano up your nose? Well, it's or a special oregano and other oils. Oh, to make your nose? That's a it's natural uh, spray thing for, uh, I guess, when you are kind of like... Sick? Sinus. Oh, sinus, sinus. yeah. I got sinus, but I yeah. was mulching the leaves and I told them, this is the time I should have worn triple mask. Yeah. Next time I will do that because I'm allergic to like dust. 
Oh, oh dust, yeah. yeah. I know there's Chinese books that they put out um, that talk about um, um, foods and stuff if you're various illnesses. Yes. They, they've been doing that for a lot. Traditional Chinese medicine. Oh, oh, you know, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 He had loosed his faithful Latin by his terrible sweet sword. Today his truth is marching on. I sent him in the watch fire of a hundred circling camps. We don't know the words. Filled him an altar in the evening dews and damps. I have read his righteous sentence. By the dim and flaring lamps, his day is marching on. Oh, yeah. Glory, glory, hallelujah. Glory, glory, hallelujah. Glory, glory, hallelujah. His truth is marching on. Yeah. I'm trying to get together with a couple of my buddies here, and uh, I'm gonna break up my SG electric guitar. Do like a rock. I want to do. A, I got a rock and roll version of they do with the band that used to be in. I'm trying to get them together. I'll make a video of it. So my, with me, I, I got a buddy that's a drummer and a friend of mine, uh, the, the guitar player can also play bass, and I have a, I have an electric guitar, I'm going to break out for it. <laughs> the grace shall be that the hero born of woman, crush the serpent with his heel, our God is marching on he has sounded forth the trumpet that shall never call retreat he is sifting out the hearts of men before his judgment seat oh be swift my soul to answer him be jubilant my feet our god is marching on everybody now Hallelujah. Glory, glory, hallelujah. Glory, glory, hallelujah. His truth is marching on. His truth is marching on. His truth is marching on. <laughs> this, world, this world will pass away, but my word will never pass away. I posted on Facebook. That's so large. Yeah, I'll put that. I'll post it here. I'll do that right now. I'll post it on a fake look here. <laughs> Yeah. So where are you posting that, Scotty? You're posting it to your page, right, Scotty? I'll, I'll send you an email. You got a computer with speakers at home? Uh, I just got my iPad. Oh, okay. So it's, it's not too bad. It's better than me doing things. Yeah. No, I like, when I play music, I like the speakers, like with bass in them, so you can crank them. Yeah, it's not going to be the same volume. So what grade are you in now, Diana? Ninth? Yeah. How about you, Bruce? What grade are you in? Uh, I'm gonna ask him. Well, it's all based on height, you know. There's grade A, taller. there's grade B, there's grade C. Yeah, okay. <coughs> uh, we're just all, you know, a disciple of Christ. Is, uh, you know, learning from the great teacher. We're learning from Jesus. We're all learning. We're all his servants. That's all we are. I got my reading glasses on, I can't see.
Is you don't have to pray. Is someone going to do the litany of the Blessed Virgin Mary, or is that, is that going to be at the end of the rosary? <laughs> That's not the end, right? That's usually what I do. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so I, I don't think you do either. No. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Yeah. Because, uh, yeah. 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 Christ is the... Yep, you know, it's, he's praying for us. He's our intercessor. Yeah, Jesus is our intercessor. I wonder what these guys are doing over here. Oh, they're doing a photo shoot. So, I... I hope you guys don't mind us. Well, you keep on praying, we'll just circle. We're used to doing, remember? So Rita and I are going to... You guys are going to watch? We're going to walk it. Yeah, it's pretty oh. cold. Like in the old days. We'll just circle the whole place. We'll concentrate. We're going to concentrate. Oh, okay. All right. Okay, Joyce and Nancy. Yeah. I think so. Yeah. Okay, so what we're standing here today is uh, we're going to ask St. Michael to protect our police so that they can protect us. Um, and it's just, just the prayers for, for protection for our police and showing support for our police. And uh, we're, we're going to do um, a, a program today at, that includes the Holy Rosary. So um, we'll start out with uh, the prayer of Immaculate Mary. Uh, Immaculate Mary, thy praises we sing, who reignest in splendor with Jesus our King. Ave, Ave, Maria, Ave, Ave, Maria. Um, I guess we're supposed to sing that, aren't we? Yeah, like, uh, well, I, I know what that goes. Ave, 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 Maria. But I'm not sure. Yeah, I'm not sure if I know This is Immaculate Mary, yes. thy praises we sing. Who reigneth in splendor with Jesus our King? Ave, 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 Maria. Ave, 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 Maria. In heaven the blessed thy glory proclaim. On earth we thy children in both thy fair name. They're singing pretty well. Be brought to the glory of his resurrection 
through the same Christ our Lord. Amen.
polymer, the mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those who most need of thy mercy. The second joyful mystery, the visitation. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our 
Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Glory be to the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be. world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. The fourth joyful mystery, the presentation in the temple. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day your daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be. The world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins. Save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. The fifth joyful mystery, the finding of the child Jesus. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Hail 
Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Glory be to the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Hail, Holy Queen, God of mercy, our life for me. Servants may enjoy perpetual health of mind and body, and by 
by the intercession of the Blessed Mary, ever virgin, may be delivered from present sorrow and obtain eternal glory through Christ our Lord. Amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. If you guys get cold, you can get right in front of that heater. It'll warm you right up. <laughs> Mostly forward. I can't spin it bi-directionally. It throws a lot of heat, especially if it's if it's not windy.
praises. Bless be God. Bless be His holy name. Bless be Jesus Christ, true God and true man. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Blessed be His most sacred heart. Blessed be His most precious blood. Blessed be Jesus in the most holy sacrament of the altar. Blessed be the Holy Spirit, the Paraclete. Blessed be the Great Mother of God, the very most holy. Blessed be her holy and immaculate conception. Blessed be her glorious assumption. Blessed be the new Mary, Virgin and Mother. Blessed be Saint Joseph, her most chaste spouse. Blessed be God in his angels and in his saints. May the heart of Jesus in the most blessed sacrament be praised, adored, and loved with grateful affection at every moment in all the tabernacles of the world, even to the end of time. Amen. Funding? Defund, there'll be no defunding the police. <laughs> we will be defending the police. We love you very much. And that we appreciate uh, all the hard work, you know? Yes, and, and your families too. Your families have to stay behind you and support you. And you have the full support of God Almighty. And uh, that's when you have that, you have everything. So thank you very, very much. God bless you all. We say prayers every day for each and every one of you. For your It's always good to be at least two. Yes. Better yeah, than being better by yourself. Alone. Unless yeah. you're gonna walk around or <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we we also more. have we also have people walking and praying the rosary, walking around the perimeter. Yeah. That's, that's <laughs> they just want to get some exercise so they don't get cold. We've, we've got the the whole sphere covered. <laughs> church at one end and I, I parked up there and I walked down and I always feel like I'm bringing Jesus and the Blessed Mother, the Holy Spirit and God the Father with me and all the saints, all the angels, you know, when we walk from the Catholic Church down to, to the state capital. That's what we always have to keep in mind that God is always watching over our country and always watching over us and we just need to continue to send up prayers and not give up hope. And we need to acknowledge that God is with us. He's always with us. The thing is, we turn around and, and we ignore him, you know? But he's the one to help us in any situation. Whereas this thing happening around the world, falling apart, you know? And even the Advarita, so many things are happening. It's like a tribulation. But if we don't turn and open our hearts to God, we are not going to get help. We cannot fix it. Only God can fix everything. But starting by your own problems, personal problems, and then you step out of your house, and there is a lot more. And now it's like I have uh, had to a couple of people that they say, well, I'll just move somewhere else. And like, oh yeah, to which 
planet because you know wherever you go it's gonna just only be worse we are at the greatest part here we are blessed by being in this country we still have a voice but uh, if you're gonna go to a different place i don't know what you're gonna do just go and hide in a cave they will come and get you so but um, you're brave. Yeah, let's not be afraid. Well, we were born for these times. God would not have put us down here unless we, he would equip us and we just need to turn to him knowing that he will give us everything we need in the time in the time frame that we need it. And that we will be victorious. The Bible tells us so. So as long as we keep that in mind and we keep praying and we keep the faith and we just have to keep each other's morale up. It's a very difficult time and it's going to get more difficult. But we were made for these times. And God will not forsake us. Yeah. If you come into a good stage, every Saturday you're here. Yep. Almost, really? or, um, or every, day, every Saturday, yeah. Every Saturday. Yeah, I would have the other Diana things. Diana sometimes. Yeah. We do different stuff. Yeah. But yeah. We have other denominations. Yeah. Yeah. We, we do prayer, though, every, every Saturday. Yeah, there's always prayer. We welcome whoever wants to come, so... Yeah, not only the Rosalie. The Rosalie is, the Rosalie is mainly Catholic, you know, but I know many other people that they come and pray. They do pray because if they are just... Well, part of the reason why we come here is to show that we can, too. Yes. And show that it's safe and that there's no reason not to. Because if you give up, you know, you concede. Soldiers of the cross, soldiers of the cross don't give up. We ask so much of our military, we ask so much of our police officers and our first responders, our firefighters and all. We have to accept a lot of ourselves too, you know, and there's nothing wrong with that. We, we're needed. We can't be shy and, and or, or just avoid the confrontation. I find it funny because I'm the only one on my block that has a back to blue sign. I got two of them in really? my yard. I'm the only one on my block. And you know what? I don't care. That back to blue. Oh, yes. I love well, it. You know, I'm the only one in our block or even the neighborhood that has thank you police officers, yeah. you know, in, in our area. Yeah. And actually, I found a sign uh, flying in the street, in the main street, you know, in the avenue. And then I put it back. And then I don't know if the wind or someone vandalized it, and I found it, you know, again. But then I couldn't find the wires to put it there, so I thought I'll take it home. I just put it on my yard. It has been there for a couple of years. Yeah. But I'm the only one that has that sign. Mm -hmm. That's wonderful. I live in the heart of Minneapolis, and I've had my, my sign up all along. That exact one. Yeah. Unfortunately, my. We have covenants in our neighborhood. We're not allowed to put signs up except political signs, right? You know, before elections. However, I fly my flag proudly. <coughs> and uh, when when uh, President Trump was here, and I don't think who it was his was it his daughter was here for the police to to uh, to honor our police force. I went to that, and I didn't know any other things as well. But you know, it's important. Uh, we had we had gangs coming out to my neighborhood. This Carjacking, and you know our police were out there. Someone found them on the rear front. They're out there in the middle of the night. Our police with spotlights trying to catch these guys, and they caught 11 of the 12. But um, this is the kind of thing they they're in danger, and or, or you know we're in danger if we don't have our police, and our police put their lives <laughs> on the line for us. And so many times we're sleeping peacefully and not realizing they're out there fighting off the bad guys. They're out there protecting us so that we can sleep. And um, I honor them for that because when the, most people run away from danger, they run towards it. And that takes great courage and love. And you don't do something like that unless you're passionate and you love people and love our country. So God bless them all. Thank you, yeah. Thank you, thank you.
You should warm up on the stove. The stove is good. Just don't get don't get too close to it. I get so nervous. I don't get what I Chevy pickup and converted it basically to a Corvette. It has a Corvette transmission, Corvette uh, um, engine, and then also the air conditioning and the whole deal. And a 49 Chevy, and uh, it would go so much faster because it would be that big war. It would go faster than the Corvette car because the engine of that car was, the truck was so light. So I had them wouldn't structurally reinforce it and stop the road and embracing so it wouldn't wrap it up. The engine truck was so hard. Yeah, I think this is my first one. Yeah, it's not my first one. Thinking about it. Yeah, 
Yeah. 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 Yeah.